Welcome to 18 Reasons and Cooking Matters Smart Snackers Interactive Lesson. Today we will learn how to read a food label, how to spot a smart snack, and you'll get some ideas for smart snacks that you can make at home. 18 Reasons is a nonprofit community cooking school based in San Francisco that teaches the Cooking Matters cooking and nutrition curriculum to kids and adults across the Bay Area. It's important to know what you're actually eating when you reach for your favorite packaged snacks. All packaged foods have a nutrition label, usually on the back or side of the package. Let's see what these labels can tell us. Most nutrition labels look something like this. One of the most important things to notice is a food serving size and how many servings there are per container. The rest of the nutrition facts only tell us what's in one serving of the food. Some other important things to look at are the total fats and total added sugars. Sugars are naturally occurring in different types of foods but many companies add more sugar on top of what's already there. This is called added sugar. Both fats and sugars are important to be aware of because too much of either can be bad for you. In general, a value of less than 5% is considered low and one above 20% is considered high. This food is high in added sugar, so you'd probably not want to eat it every day. Another thing to look at is the ingredients list, which is usually found beneath or next to the nutrition label. You usually want to stay away from foods with long lists of ingredients, especially when they contain things that you don't recognize or that don't seem like food, things like preservatives and chemicals. This is also where you'll find allergy information in case you're looking out for something that you can't eat. Now let's practice what you've learned on some snack foods. There are 16 servings in this container. This snack is low in both fat and sugar. The ingredients list isn't very long and contains mostly things you'd expect to see in this type of snack. This is a smart snack choice. The serving size of this drink is one bottle, but we can see that it's very high in sugar. This is a snack that we might not want to have too often. Looking at some other common packaged snacks, we can see that many of them are very high in fats and sugars and have serving sizes smaller than what many people usually eat. So how can we snack smarter? Always read the label of a food to know what and how much you're eating. Try to choose snacks that contain at least one fruit or vegetable. If you can, make your own snacks. Now think of some of your favorite snacks. How could you make them smarter? Maybe you could choose a lower fat option or eat a smaller portion. Could you make this snack or something like it yourself or with help? Here are some easy smart snack ideas that you can make at home. Sliced fruit with a yogurt dip, homemade guacamole or salsa that you could eat with tortilla chips, and a smart soda made with fruit, sparkling water, or anything else you'd like. You can look online for more ideas like these or smarter versions of your favorite snacks. Now for a challenge. Make your next snack a smart one. Try making a snack yourself or with help, or try something you've never tried before. You did it. Now you can be a smart snacker. Thanks for watching.